We know they're on the road, and we know they don't have to be. Everybody should have a plan to DD when they go out for the night. Did you have a fun night out tonight? Oh, yeah, always a good time at Algaris. He's getting you on home safe tonight. I appreciate the ride home. Not a problem. Let me get the door for you. Thank you, sir. There are so many options for people to get a sober driver. And in the Twin Cities, one company feels it has found the best service yet. We started DDI in 2005 uh, after seeing a lot of our friends and family members getting DUIs and uh, making the mistake of driving while intoxicated. Uh, we really saw there was a need to get people home with their cars. Brian Peters and a bunch of his high school friends started Drink and Drive Intelligently, a service that sends a driver to drive you and your car home. We saw a great need for the service. Um, people tend to drink and drive because of the need to get their car home. What started as a small company out of White Bear Lake quickly grew to 30 drivers and the entire metro. Our drivers are stationed for your convenience all over the Twin Cities. It's become so popular that the liquor industry and the bars yeah. themselves You guys doing okay? Yeah, thank you. Good. Good. Heavily promote DDI. Planning on drinking so much and then you do, but you need to get your car home because you have work in the morning. Or... Bars like O'Gara's in St. Paul are a proud partner. Kind of an untapped market really. No one had been doing it in the cities. It was really before Uber and Lyft and all that stuff kind of got started. There's a $35 pickup fee and it's $4 a mile for the ride with options to reserve a ride ahead of time or just call on demand. Well, thanks for coming and picking me up. Absolutely. For Brian and his friends, the success of the business is nothing compared to the reward of keeping drunk drivers off the roads. It's very rewarding because every time somebody uses us and gets home safe, you know that would be a person that otherwise would most likely have driven their car and you know could cause damage to themselves or to somebody else.